I mean, if you, I have two children, and uh, by 15 month old, my wife says he eats like a first grader. So I mean, we're gonna need to keep working, do something. He just, for what I feel like I need to do to provide for my family, even if my career, if my career were to end today, I'm 27. I mean, that's like at least 25 years of. I need something to do, and um, there's a little, I have a lot of interests, but I also need an income. So, uh, and I'm really passionate about science. Now, it's possible that you know I get to that point where I decide, decide uh, don't want to keep playing, or people don't want me to play anymore for them. And I don't go to medical school, but I go somewhere else in the healthcare field. Maybe a uh, Maybe I go into research or, you know, as a lab tech or yeah. um, go to a different professional school um, or teach or something. You know. Still what you see down the road for yourself at some point, being in the medical profession. I'm just really, I just really like science in, in, in general. That's a passion of mine, and that's what I would see myself doing when this is over. If you were to see it all the way through to, to becoming a doctor, is there a specialization that particularly... It's changed over the years. I think now... That, the longer I've played and that I have two kids, it becomes more about hours worked. And that eliminates a lot of specialties in the field. So I not only, and, and honestly, just in my experience, experiences being a player, uh, dealing with healthcare, I'm leaning more towards like a primary care, general practitioner type thing. What about teaching something like that? Would that be your concern? That would be, yeah, like teaching, a, teaching some sort of science, something like that. That would interest me, yeah. I'd consider it.